This is Artifacts of Mars. When I first saw this headline, I said, good. But uh, hold your horses on that. NASA launched asteroid deflection mission. For the first time ever, an asteroid deflection technique for planetary defense is set to be tested out, known as DART, Double Asteroid Redirection Test. The mission will demonstrate how a potentially deadly asteroid impact can be averted by striking an object with enough force to shift its trajectory away from Earth, method known as the kinetic impactor technique. While still in the preliminary design phase, the goal of the mission will be to strike Diddy Moss B, the smaller of two binary asteroids that will approach the Earth in 2022 and again, then again in 2024. A binary asteroid is perfect natural laboratory for this test, said program scientist Tom Statler. The fact that Diddy Moss B is in orbit around Diddy Moss A makes it easier to see results of the impact and ensures that the experiment doesn't change that orbit of the pair around the sun. Now, what is the point of doing this if they're not going to actually deflect it? In other words, they're going to take, spend all this money on a rocket, they're going to hit the thing, at least they're going to try to hit the thing, but they're not really trying to deflect it. What's the point of this test? At, at around the size of a fridge, DART would use on, its onboard autonomous target system to aim directly at the Lima speed before striking it at a speed nine times faster than that of a bullet. DART is a critical step in demonstrating that we can protect our planet from future asteroid impacts with Andy Cheng of Johns Hopkins Applied Physics Laboratory in Laurel, Maryland. Since we don't know that much about the internal structure or composition, we need to perform this experiment on a real asteroid. Uh, anybody say a welfare for scientists? I don't know. Dart, we can now show how to protect our from an asteroid strike with a kinetic impactor by knocking the hazardous object to a slightly different flight path that would not threaten the planet. But you're not trying to do that. You're just trying to hit the thing without doing any real, without actually deflecting it. So you're not going to prove anything. science update for today. I'm not sure what the point of this is other than welfare for scientists. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.